Metro homicide detectives want you to take a closer look now more than ever at this store shooting suspect. He is still at large today after several people misidentified him. And that actually put police back at square one in their search to find who shot and killed an assistant manager at a Dollar General store. Yeah, Crime Beat reporter Steve Jefferson joins us live from IMPD headquarters to explain how you can help. Steve? Yeah, Andrea and Scott, right now, homicide detectives here at the Metropolitan Police Department headquarters say everyone can help by taking a very close look at this video once again so they can get the name of the right suspect to get him off the street. When Metro Police released this video of a robber suspected of shooting and killing a store clerk, several anonymous tips came in, giving them leads on the case. This video is from the Dollar General store on Emerson Way. Memorial Day weekend, these still photos from the video show the suspect inside the store for about 30 minutes. Then, with customers in the store, the robber reportedly shot and killed assistant manager Brian Urey. His mother and wife pleaded for the public's help during this interview with Eyewitness News. We're not begging the community to do anything to bring this man to... He need, we need justice for this family. We need closure. 13 investigates learned homicide detectives thought they were moving toward closing the case after anonymous tips from several people who gave the same name of the man caught on camera. Sources also tell Eyewitness News that when detectives showed witnesses a photo lineup, the different witnesses picked out the same man, naming Douglas Cobbs as the robber. But Cobbs provided an airtight alibi, proving he had already taken off aboard an airplane heading to Las Vegas at the time of the murder. Since the deadly shooting, Dollar General has added a security guard to work at the store. In the meantime, as far as this suspect video, police hope to get an entire new round of anonymous tips so they can bring Brian's killer to justice. He needs to be off the street. He killed a man in cold blood. Yeah, we'll keep that video posted on our Facebook page and website for you to take another look. If you recognize him, call Crime Stoppers at 317-262-TIPS. On the Crime Beat, I'm Steve Jefferson.